How's it going, everybody? Y'all know who it is. Lonson Jerry, I am back again. I'm getting ready to go to work, guys, so uh, the video's not going to be long at all. So, right now, it's too hot outside, but uh, I'm getting ready to, uh, to take the rims off the car. Make sure the top is, is clean before I even put my tires in the back. Uh, plan on getting up out of here probably by the end of the month, so I want to make sure everything is done before I get ready to leave up out of here. But I'm gonna stay stick around until uh, after my uh, family reunion is over with out here. So we got fam family reunion going on out here on the 23rd up to the 25th. So I want to make sure everything is okay before I get ready to leave out of here. So I will be traveling back in Red Ruby, back on the highway. A lot of people don't want me to get back on the highway, but I don't have no other choice but to do it. So me and my cousins are uh, gonna be riding back out that way. So hopefully I got someone to drive the car with me. That way I ain't gotta drive for that whole 23 hours. You know what I'm saying? I can drive for 12 hours, but after that somebody else have to take over from there. But uh, we're gonna try and get things going and be done with it. So as y'all see, Red Ruby is dirty, dirty, dirty man. So like I said, I got. My uh, camera stuff in here. I gotta get my jack stand in here and stuff for my for, for my car. I got my drill. Got some clothes on the side, shoes on the other side. But uh, y'all see, ain't no room in there to put no rims. That box is so big, guys. I ain't taking it out. It's gonna stay put. But uh, anyway, like I said, we wanna get that tarp. I wanna get that tarp clean. So I'm gonna uh, wash it off real good, and then I'll be ready to. Uh, Take on from this. Look like somebody knocked it on the ground. Yep, knocked it on the ground. But that's the top right there. So that's going back on the car, guys. So um, that's gonna get put in the car. So they're gonna raise some tires. Sit right there. Look like I got a tire missing somewhere. Well, I got a tire missing. I know I had another tire. I got. All right, one, two, three, four. Okay, I got all four tires. That's good. The wind must have knocked it off, but we're you gonna know, put this back in the car. So once I got this all into the car, then I can get my tires in there. So, yep, that's going back in. So, uh, make sure that's locked back. Got to lock this up. Shut that door on that. Yeah, guys, it's very hot outside. It's like a hundred something something out here. So I know what that hundred something something out here, but Red Roof is dirty as crap. I'm not going to wash it no more because every time I wash the car, she get dirty up. You know what I'm saying? It looks like it's going to rain every night, but it's raining somewhere. So we're not going to worry about cleaning him back up no more for a minute. Nothing. I ran into a lizard in the garage last night. And I ran into a scorpion too last night, but I got to make sure there's no scorpions on that tarp back there before I put it in the car because I want them biting me down the road. So that's not going to be happening at all. But y'all gotta understand, these are 22 inch rims on here, low profiles, and I can get all four of them in there with no problem, you know. But uh, we're gonna step back in before the car, uh, phone get hot and decide to turn off. So, when it get hot outside, the phone don't last long. So I don't know what's going on, but my camera's in there uploading the video for me, so I can't do nothing with that. That's gonna stay there, cause I'm finna get ready and go to work. And uh, you know, I'm just going to be playing play it safe, you know. I'm going to go ahead and get back on the highway and do what I got to do, you know. And uh, make sure I get back to Illinois with no problem. I can't wait to get back there. So, this weather out here is just kicking butt. But I heard Illinois is kicking butts out there too with that weather. But y'all got to understand, Illinois do get hot out there. But it rains. And when it rains, it pours. So, out here... No rain and it doesn't pour. So it does rain in certain parts of Arizona, but one mat and globe is globe globe whatever is it don't rain over here. You know, I see the rain coming in, next minute we don't see nothing. The rain be doing all these crazy turns. But it be raining all up in Scottsdale and stuff like that, you know, or Maricopa. But man, we don't get it here. I don't know what it is. I guess we're too close to the mountains. So, um, 
Yeah, yeah. You want some rain, you gotta go closer to them towns. You no, know, those are more like an hour drive away from here. So, a lot of people say 45 minutes. I say an hour because, yeah, you gotta follow the speed limits out there. Otherwise, the cops got you. So, I ain't trying to get pulled over. So, I'm following the speed limit. It's gonna take me an hour to get out there. But uh, I'm not going nowhere until after the front, after the family reunion is over with. When that's over with out here, then I'll be getting myself prepared to get ready to get back on the highway and get back to Illinois. So that's going to be a, a crazy drive. But all the ones that I want me to drive back, I, pre I apologize to you guys, you know what I'm saying? But it got to be done. You know, I got to get back. You know, it cost too much money to have the car towed back. So I will be driving it back home. It's on no more than 240 bucks on gas. That's included with that one tow. So one tow to go through and that's it, but rest of it's in to gas. Gas and eating and stuff like that, but 240 bucks, 250 would get me there, you know what I'm saying? Because I don't eat a lot when I'm on the road. I can't eat a lot when I'm on the road. Like I said, eat too much on the road. I'm the only one that's driving. I get tired, be trying to go to sleep. So no, that's not gonna happen. As long as they got a coffee shop out there somewhere, I'm good, you know. So I end up carrying my big old coffee mug thing with me, you know, it stays hot 24 hours around the clock, you know what I'm saying? So I ain't got to worry about my coffee going bad. I can drink my coffee all day long until nighttime, whatever. But uh, next time I leave, I'll be leaving out of here like uh, early in the morning. So that way, you know, 23 hours, I'll be able to get there then the next day, whatever, in the morning, you know, and I'll be there during daytime instead of nighttime, so, nighttime, you don't get a lot of people out there, so, just gotta be careful and, and keep on rolling, you know, stay away from the trucks and stuff like that, trucks don't bother me, but the trucks be driving crazy too, you know what I'm saying, they don't be following the speed limit, you know, they be doing 90, 95 on the highway, they don't care either, so, uh, they got places to be too, just like we gotta have places to be, but, uh, Everything is ready to go on my end. Once I get there, I got the job already set up, ready for me to go to work. The apartment is already set up for me to go ahead and move in. And then uh, and I'll be all good to go, you know. So that's one thing I can't wait for is being back there for that. So um, when I get ready to leave, I'll let you guys know. And uh, I will be doing live streams, you know. I'm not, not doing videos. You do videos, you have to wait till you get where you're going and stuff like that. You got so many videos to upload, upload, upload. But that's fine too. I can do videos too, but, you know, uh, I'd be able to do a lot of stuff out there. But the main thing is to be safe, you know, traveling back to Illinois, you know, and just take my time. And I get there safe, I'd be all right with, you know what I'm saying? Just got to watch out for other drivers out here and just continue doing what I got to do. And that's it. So... I'm going back to be with my wife. I miss her dearly. I love her so much with all my heart. Can nobody replace that, you know what I'm saying? But me and her, you know what I'm saying? So I can't wait to get back home to my number one love, you know? But it's time to get back anyway, you know? If I can be back there with her. Because I need her, you know what I'm saying? And I think she needs me too. But I need her more than anything in this world. So I will be going back. And um, I need you guys to go ahead and hit the notification bell for Lost with Jerry. Uh, appreciate everybody out there. I love you all. You know, we all one big happy family. Even though we're not blood, but we are one big happy family. You know what I'm saying? But uh, I love you guys the same way I love my family. Always been in my heart. Always. All the good comments come through, man. I love you guys. You know what I'm saying? Those are the ones. That's one big happy family. All the crazy ones that leaving all that crazy junk. Ain't no part of family here. So all the ones that leaving all that good stuff on my channel. Y'all are my family. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate every last one of y'all. I really do. But then again, Lost with Jerry got to get up off of here. I got to get on this side of here. Get my shoes on and... Red Ruby is cooling off because it's so hot outside. It says 100 degrees inside the garage, but 
On the outside, it's like 110, maybe climbing up to 120. I don't know. I don't watch the news like that out here because ain't no need to watch it. I'm afraid to see the numbers. You know what I'm saying? When I say 125, I panic. So I don't want to panic. So I want to be comfortable with this. But I can't be outside in that heat too much because you can drink water, but that water is not going to last long. You know, you put a towel, wet towel over your head. That wet towel going to drop in three seconds. So ain't no need to do that either. Ain't no wasting your time doing a towel, wet towel on your body. It's going to dry just like you've been in that dryer uh, inside the oven. You know what I'm saying? So ain't no need for all that. When you wash your car, it's best to wash your car in the middle of the night, late night. You know what I'm saying? The sun is not out and it's not drying up quicker. So when you go wash your car, it's going to dry. As soon as you come out, most of the car washers out here don't have the blowers. When that car get done washing, when they go through them brushes, come on out in that sun, boom, your car is dried up. Ain't no need to get out and dry it off. The heat got it. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I said a lot of people out here wash their cars in the middle of the night. Like 2 o'clock in the morning, 3 o'clock in the morning, wash their cars. Don't go to the car wash in the daytime because, hey, I don't care what kind of towel you got, that, that bad boy gonna drive quick. He's gonna drive quick. So you can't keep up with it. So that's why I come out on and bother trying to wash the car for that reason too. And I don't wash the car because it wanna rain every night. Where, wherever I'm at, it got clouds covered, looking crazy, but no rain. I guess soon as it, it might be raining, but it's not hitting the ground. You know what I'm saying? So. It's raining, but it ain't hitting the ground. It's drying up before it get to the ground. You know what I'm saying? So it's kind of weird. So that's what I saw last night. Some great clouds, red clouds. You know what I'm saying? And that, they say it's raining, but I don't see nothing. You know what I'm saying? So it's, it's, it's weird. So the desert is, is a, it's a good place to live if you retire, but when you got to go to work every day, it's not, it ain't no good. And then again, you want to hang out, it ain't no good. Wait till it get dark. Cause a lot of places out here stay open late out here at the clubs, eating places and stuff like that. They wait till it get dark before anybody start going out having some fun some kind of way. But I go to work and come home, so I don't have time to hang out. Work and home, and that's it. Just chill out because it's too hot outside. I can't deal with the heat. But anyway, guys, I'm gonna get ready and get up over here. Lost with Jay, we gotta get inside and like I said, gotta get my shoes. You know, get my shoes on. And get to work and uh, hope everything goes right. You know what I'm saying? I'm doing overtime as much as I can before I can get up out of here. But uh, I'm loving it. As y'all see, I still got the charm. Still got it. You know what I'm saying? Nice and pretty and beautiful. You know what I'm saying? She stay clean all the time. You know what I'm saying? So uh, she's all good. But now she can't talk because I got duct tape around the mouth. So she can't speak. So you can't hear it. You know what I'm saying? So... It's all good here, you know what I'm saying? But uh, we both appreciate you all, you know what I'm saying? So uh, I'm going to go and get up off here and I'll catch y'all next video next time. Lost with Jerry, 32 Gang, peace. We out.